Listen here, family. Listen up, listen up, listen up. I don't know who went to the Cherry Hill Mall and interviewed the Asian American vendor. I don't know who did it. I am amazed that we in the African community have so much time to play games when we have real problems that need to be solved. I don't know who went to the mall. I didn't send them to the mall. I don't care what you think about me. I'm Mr. Unapologetically African. I let the chips fall where they may. If you for me, you for me. And if you not for me, you not for me. It don't make a difference. So I don't know who wasted their time to go to the Cherry Hill Mall. But I'm glad that the interview happened. So everybody knows that the Prince of Pan-Africanism, King Kong Consciousness, the notorious RBG, the most influential black consciousness personality and scholar in the world, is innocent of all charges. Okay, there may be times when you can't be proven innocent of a charge. So I don't live my life based on public approval. I don't live my life based on whether you like me or not. I don't live my life based on public approval. Do you think I spent my whole life fighting white supremacy at every stage of my life? In the class, out the class, in the court, out the court to succumb to a bunch of Negro peons who are not interested in liberty. They're not interested in freedom. They're not interested in emancipation. They're not interested in justice. They're just interested in a couple of jokes, likes, new subscribers, views and AdSense at the expense of another African. So today in Atlanta, I'm about to go and participate in this second annual Black Wall Street Black Business Expo. And if you are in the Atlanta area, come on out and join us. If you are in the Atlanta area, come on out and join us. We are at the Peachtree Plaza Hotel. We are at the Peachtree Plaza Hotel, 210 Peachtree, downtown Atlanta. The doors are open, the vendors are getting it in, and we're gonna have a serious discussion on how to economically empower African people. That's why I'm in Atlanta today. That's why I'm in Atlanta today. Okay? Okay? It's been 101 years since the Tulsa bombing. It's been 101 years since the Tulsa bombing. Even longer for Wilmington, North Carolina. We've had Rosewood, Florida. All these black Wall Streets burned to the ground. When are we going to come together and rebuild Black Wall Street? When are we going to come together and rebuild Black Wall Street? That's what it's about. I want my own banks. I want my own schools. I want my own hospitals. I want my own supermarkets. I want my own African post office. I want my own factories. I want my own ships, my own distribution. You can sum Pan-Africanism up in four words. I want my own. I said you can sum Garveyism up in four words. Where's my red, black, and green flag at? Where's my red, black, and green flag? It's called our own brothers and sisters. We are building the Frederick Douglass and Marcus Garvey Academy to teach our children how to... I need some cologne on. Gotta put some cologne on. We must stay focused, brothers. We must stay focused, brothers. We must stay focused. Let's get organized. Let's get organized. Charlotte, North Carolina, Saturday, June 18th, House of Africa. Charlotte, North Carolina, Saturday, June 18th, House of Africa. Charlotte, North Carolina, Saturday, June 18th, House of Africa, Juneteenth celebration. Sunday, June 19th, HBCU, I said HBCU, Benedict College, Columbia, South Carolina, at the stadium on the Benedict College campus, the Columbia, South Carolina, official Juneteenth program, and I will bless the stage. So Carolina has me this year for Juneteenth. North Carolina Saturday, South Carolina Sunday. Mobile, Alabama, and Pritchard, we working on you. Mobile, Alabama, and Pritchard, we working on you. Mobile, Alabama, and Pritchard, we looking for Monday the 21st. And then the next week, Duncanville, Texas. Duncanville, Texas. My good sister Veronica with the Holistic Health Expo. 
Duncanville, Texas, my good sister Veronica with the Holistic Health Expo. Make sure you go to eventbrite.com. Make sure you go to eventbrite.com and get your tickets for the Holistic Health Expo in Duncanville, Texas. Make sure you go to eventbrite.com and get your tickets. Nah, this is, not, this is my Prada cologne that was sent to me for my birthday last year. I got this in the mail from a supporter for my birthday. And it's, I kept it, I only wear it for special occasions because it was anonymous birthday gift. A beautiful sister sent me this. Ladies, I want my birthday gifts, August 21st. Don't forget, P.O. Box 6872, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Ladies, I want my birthday gifts, P.O. Box 6872, Philadelphia, PA. But let's get back to the Garveyism. Let's get back to the Garveyism. Hit the cash app, dollar sign FDMG school. Hit the cash app, dollar sign FDMG school. Hit the PayPal, paypal.me slash FDMG Academy. Hit the cash app for our boys. We are trying to save black boys. Hit your cash app, dollar sign FDMG school. Hit your PayPal, paypal.me slash FDMG Academy. I need sponsors for the shockumentary documentary. I need sponsors for the psychoacademic war against black boys. Shockumentary documentary. Will you help your brother King Kong consciousness out? $100 basic sponsor for the documentary. $250 VIP sponsor for the documentary. $500 elite sponsor for the documentary. You can send your donation. PayPal. Cash. Uh, PayPal.me slash Umar the psychologist. Cash app. Dollar sign Dr. Umar Johnson or Zell using my cell number. PayPal.me slash Umar the Psychologist. Cash.me slash Dollar sign Dr. Umar Johnson or use your Zell. 215-989-9858. Screenshot your receipt. Text it to me in WhatsApp. 215-989-9858. I'm going to add you to the special shockumentary sponsorship WhatsApp chat. You're going to be the first to see the documentary. You're going to get an exclusive screening, all the food you want, buffet style, exclusive screening of the documentary for all of my sponsors. If you are a mid-level sponsor, you will get a signature Dr. Umar, a signature Dr. Umar poster and DVD. And if you are an elite level sponsor, you get your own screening. The elites get their own screening. They get the hoodie, they get the t-shirt, and they also get access to any documentary screening for free for an entire year. So if you want to support the documentary, if you want to support independent, real black documentaries, brothers and sisters, consider being a sponsor for the documentary. We start filming next week and I need some funding. I'm not going to white folks. I'm not going to the government. I'm not going to corporate America. I'm not going to white banks. I'm going to you because we are a two trillion dollar economy. There's no need for King Kong consciousness to be going to anybody outside the black community. So we here, Atlanta pull up. Got to find out where I'm going to have dinner tonight. Where do I eat? Where, where am I coming for dinner in Atlanta? Where the black-owned restaurants at? Where am I coming for dinner in Atlanta tonight? Where the black-owned restaurants at? If you have a testimonial, if you are a black man who went through hell in the school system and you're willing to be interviewed, if you're a black mother, black father, black teacher, black police officer, probation officer, retired judge, youth worker, if you had a community organization and you got a testimonial on how a black boy you know, he might be a man now, but when he was a boy, he might be a man, but when he was a boy, you saw the school miseducate him. You saw the school special educate him. You saw the school psychiatrically medicate him. You saw the school and I'll incarcerate him. If you saw the school psychologically destroy him and he might have even been incarcerated, he might have committed suicide, God forbid, he might have got involved in gangs, he might have committed a homicide. If you are willing to tell the story of your son, your nephew, your cousin, your brother, your student, your client, if you are willing to tell the story and you live in Maryland, D.C., Delaware, Pennsylvania, New York, or New Jersey. I repeat, New Jersey, New York, Pennsylvania, Delaware, Maryland, D.C. If you have a story for the movie, 
we are going to expose the psychoacademic holocaust. All those documentaries you saw about what happens to black children in the schools, all them documentaries you saw about black children and mental health, you have seen nothing until you've seen the shockumentary. Coming to you this Kwanzaa at the Frederick Douglass Marcus Garvey Academy. It's time for me to go do what I do better than any African in the world, and that is grab the mic and bless the spirit through oratory. I'm out. King Kong Consciousness.